hello friends today in this tutorial i'll be showing you that how to use the pdf kit library inside python to export the html to pdf so we can take the screenshot of any website let's suppose you go to google.com you need to take the screenshot of this website and export to a pdf document you can do it inside your pdf kit library inside python so this is the library i'm talking about guys which is pdf kit library it is the official website of this library pdfkit.org so basically it's a javascript pdf generation library for node and the browser you can even use this library inside your python application so i will be showing you that how to use this library inside your python application so it also offers this simple npm package as well you can use it inside your node.js application so let me just show you how to use it inside your python application so here I will be showing you a very basic example. I have written a complete blog post on my tutorial website uh, webninjadeveloper.com. The link will be there inside the description of this live stream. So step by step instruction is given inside the blog post. So it is given in the description of this blog post. So uh, the library I am talking about is PDF kit guys. So basically the command is very simple. You just need to go to the source directory and just type here pip install PDF kit. So this is the command which is required to install this library guys after you install it you just need to write a simple app.py file here inside your root directory just make an app.py file this will be the python file and here first of all we need to import the pdf kit library which we have installed guys you can see you can easily install this library and for using this library inside your desktop machine guys you require a special software to be installed it inside your software uh, wk html to pdf so this is a cross-platform software guys this needs to be installed inside your machine which lets you convert the html to pdf so basically it's a software you can install it inside a pre-compiled binary for windows system it comes in 64 bit 32 bit depending upon your operating system just install the software on cid your machine click the next next instruction and install it and then you can in use the pdf kit library so the example is very simple guys i have given the source code so now to basically there is a function available inside this module which is called as from url and here you will provide the url of whatever website that you want to convert to a pdf document let's suppose i uh, use my own website which is webninjadeveloper.com i need to convert this to a pdf document so here i will be giving a path name so let me say it is output.pdf that's it so if i now execute this python application if i write here python app.py it will now create this output.pdf file guys it will you can see that it has created output.pdf file i can simply open this file here inside google chrome so this has taken the screenshot guys of my website webninjadeveloper.com you can see exactly it contains five pages this is the first page this is the second page this is the third page fourth page and this is the fifth page so in this way guys it has taken all the pages all the screenshots of my website and it has exported to a pdf document so it is a very good library to definitely use you definitely use it pdf kit library and the second example you can take any example here let's suppose i change the website name to google.com so if i change it to google.com you will now see it will take the screenshot of google.com and it will save it as a output.pdf file here so simply wait it is creating that and once again if you open this now inside your google chrome browser so this has taken the screenshot of google.com you can now see so it's a very good library pdf kit so the next example that i want to show you guys you can even take a, a, a template from a file you can simply take a, a template here let's suppose you want to convert this a local template here which is there let's suppose i give it a file name as file.pdf so you create your own template own resume template inside index.html and uh, basically inside this template we have a h1 heading i can simply say this is a resume you can even apply some custom styles as well guys so inside this you can style this align this heading in the center position change its color to red you can even change the background color to black so this is your index.html guys template guys you can now see if you want to convert this to a export this to a pdf document you can easily do it by using pdf kit simply provide the index.html here execute this python script so now it will create this file file.pdf so if you open this inside your you can now see it is successfully exported all the css which is there guys the black background the red color text 
so if you want to change the body color let's suppose i apply here target the body change its background color to let's suppose i change it to a color so i change it to again yellow color so basically i provide body a background color of yellow so if you now want to export this to a pdf document if you once again run this command so once again if you open this now basically uh, if you open this now inside google chrome you will now see guys it will have this background here basically you will now see this background yellow also so this is the way by which you can completely control all the styles that you are needed for this you can have any template that you can export this guys basically uh, we can even take an image as well let's suppose i want to export an image so i can simply take an image from google for example let me take this image copy image address so let's suppose i attach the image here so after this we have the image element source will be equal to this image so if you open this now this is a template guys it also contains this image so if you want to convert this to a pdf document let me see if it is also exports the image as well so simply open this and uh, so now guys you can also see it also exports all the images that are present inside your template index.html file so it's very good library guys definitely it will export all the images all the css styling that you will put here and the third and the very last example guys you can even uh, put css also here there is a from you uh, from string so here you can also put custom html here you can write the custom html let's suppose i put a heading here and right here this is a custom heading so here you can even provide styles as well here so style uh, color is equal to red and then you put here output dot pdf this is a path so basically guys uh, i think yeah it needs to be going into single quotes so if you now export this basically it will now create this output.pdf file if you now open this now there will be a simple heading out there which will be in red color so you can even write like this also guys you can also provide the html right here itself this contains this method from string it will convert your html to pdf document inside your pdf kit library so these are three examples like guys i wanted to show share with you if you want to take a screenshot of the website or convert a local template of html to a pdf document you can you do it exactly inside python it's a very good library definitely use this library so thanks so much guys for watching this video please hit the like button subscribe the channel the source code will be there inside the description of this live stream and thank you very much for watching this video